哇哇哇哇哇 ！Hello, everybody. My name is Katya, and guys, welcome back to Miss Guest Squad, the geeky and let's play talk show that's all about you guys, guessed it, geeky goodness and video games. And welcome back to Spyro Reignited Trilogy. That is right, my folks. And by trilogy, I mean we are playing all the games of Spyro here on Miss Guest Squad for your guys' enjoyment. For those of you who are new, I welcome you to the squad. Um, yes, Spyro is my overall childhood. This is me being extremely hyped over everything. And I already said on Twitter that if you guys want to take part in the headphone challenge, please do by wearing headphones and try not to go deaf with me screaming because there's going to be a lot of screaming. This is no casual Let's Play channel at all. This is a crazy, loud, fun, family entertainment channel for your guys' enjoyment. And yeah, someone recently got me. This is a big shout out to squad member Scout who just got me this Spyro toy. I mean, if I had this toy growing up, oh my god, I'm living my childhood right now, guys. I'm literally living my childhood because if I had all this Spyro goodies when I was growing up, you know that this girl would go crazy. And yes, I also have the Spyro incense burner, which is all the way over there. I'm figuring to move him over here to, you know, make the shelf, you know, make it Spyro friendly and fun and happy because I, I'm, there's gonna be a ton of Spyro content here in Miss Guess One. Oh, I already pressed the button. Oh god, I'm scared because as you know, if you remember on the last time of Spyro, you know I like to finish every single world. I want to be able to get it 100% complete because if I don't, then that's going to be a whole nother let's play of me just wandering around trying to figure out what I did wrong. But yeah, hey, that's what we're doing on here. Every single episode we'll play maybe one to two worlds and different portals and this and that just so you guys can get, you know, a hint of what this game is about. Our episodes usually range from 20 to 30 minutes for you guys' enjoyment because we like to do a little short episodes on here to add some extra fun goodies for you guys. But yes, stay tuned for Spyro Stories because I have a segment on here on Miss Cat Squad within these Let's Plays that is called Spyro Story Time. So there's a lot of times that I'm going to end up talking about my childhood with Spyro or also just some fun Spyro memory so every episode you will get a new brand new story for you guys to enjoy and also I'd love to know your stories of why you love Spyro and also why you're so happy that our purple boy is back in our lives so yeah just stay tuned because there's gonna be a ton of Spyro content on Miskat Squad and let's just get back into the game shall we we're saving uh we're only 11% that's hilarious but yeah um we're doing Spyro the Dragon first then Ripto's Rage then we're going to go to Spyro Year of the Dragon my all-time favorite game out of the trilogy so let's get started here we go, 11%. We have a lot to go, my friends. This is what's exciting. New adventure. The adventure continues. And that's what we're doing on Miss Kid Squad. Lots of Spyro content. Here we go. All right, so hearty, hearty, funny, funny. Cat didn't realize that she actually got the key uh, from the last world. So let's go back here and complete this world while we're at it. Oh, get away from me, dude. This dude's chasing me. He thinks he's better than me. He thinks you're stupid. You stupid. Roasty to... I just missed that. Dude, get your butt over here. Where'd you go? Get over here! What is going on? Boom! I, dude! I'm not playing tag with you! Where'd you go? Stupid. Oh, he thinks he's better than me. You, go. you can't get me! You can't do it! Yeah, he thinks he cut in front of me. No, absolutely not. That's not gonna happen here. That's not gonna happen. Let's go, boy. He's fine. That's right. If I had this one, I would have killed. Cat, we did it! We got a Spyro toy! Fist bump to your past self! Oh! Alright, so we're going back here. Doc Hollow did not finish it, did not realize that I actually had the key. whoops a doos Let's go get it. Let's go make this 100% complete. Get away, dude! It's right up here. Hello, dude. 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 Give me! Use the key! There we go. Wait, why can't I use the key? Did I not- are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Whoa, Spyro's rolling. I really need to do that. What is going on? What is going on? Do I have to go back and get the dang key? Oh my god. Do I have to redo it? I think I have to go back and get the key. Oh, shooty, 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 fruity. All right, let's go. Um, do, 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 do. There we go. God. Get away. Turn around. Get to make your butt get hot. Get down. Get down. Imagine if you got your butt like roasted like that. Like, ow. Boo boo. Do 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 do. Ah, you down. Alright, so key. 
There it is. There she is. I was right. All right, here we go. Boop. Ah! Oh, Sparrow, why? Okay, Sparrow. Shh, shh. Now we got it. All right, now we can finish this level finally. And get back up here. I wish I could jump like Sparrow. My question is, when do... When do little dragons like Sparrow start standing on, like, two feet? Very important question. I've always wondered that. Like, Sparrow, when are you gonna be a daddy dragon? When are you, my friend, going to be a daddy dragon? Oh! Ooh. Go away. I'm just trying to get my money. Here we go. Ready? Boing! Sparrow needs his gems. He gets to buy some nice stuff. There we go. Unlock it. Yes! Finally! Look what we did. We completed it. Let's see. Did I complete it? Let's see. Yes, we did. Now let's get back into the actual gameplay. Oh, look this too. Ah, uh, the memory. Oh, look at these! Even the particles are amazing. Yeah, you know, I just, I, I want, I want to have mutton now. Like, I want to have that big chicken and just eat it. Because look how good it looks. It's getting me hungry. It's getting me hungry. Oh, God. Don't do not. Down, boy. Here we go. Poor Sparks. He's like, I'm blue now. And see, it's blue. <sighs> nice touch. Haha. -ha. I missed you. I'm not gonna kill all of them because I'm nice. Alright, now we can move on to the next world. I think we can finally go into the balloon. Hoping. The hot air balloon. Hair balloon. I can't talk. The hot air balloon. Got that boy just to He's hyped! So am I. So am I. Nutter Brothers. Nutter Butters. I love that. Sparrow, roll out of the way. Alright, so we finished this world. Which worlds have we finished? We still haven't done Sunny Flight. It's zero. Stone Hill! What are you doing to me? I gotta find the key in Stone Hill, but I might go back to that. Let me know if you guys want me to go back to that. I'm definitely going to finish every single world before we call it quits on the next one. Um, Because we're going to finish Spyro the Dragon, then uh, the go to Ripter's Rage, then go to uh, You're the Dragon, because, yeah, that's how I roll. Because I have to get 100% on everything, and you can also get, like, bonuses, but... Sunny Flight! I'm not sure if I want to do that yet, so we might as well move on to the next world. Do do. I'm just going to find the, find the balloon. Dude, I'm going to kill you. There we go. That's not the right way, cat. You know, Spyro, maybe he just wants to have a good day, you know? I remember one story, this is uh, story time. Spyro story time, yeah. All right, so one story is I remember my sister and I, my sister would do Sp Sparks' voice and I would do Spyro's voice. This is when I was young and I realized that I wanted to be a voice actor because when I was young, I didn't know that voice acting could be a job. And also I didn't realize that uh, when it came to doing characters' voices, I called it something completely different. It wasn't called voice acting for me. It was called like, I don't, know, I don't even know. It was like something pretend. I like, I gave it its own name. And I didn't realize that role-playing and anything else was, like, such a big deal. I even realized that, like, with uh, Dungeons and & Dragons and everything, it was such a big deal. And it wasn't, like, I wasn't the only one doing it. So, before I go here, let me finish. Stop waving at me. I get I get on there at my own time. So, when I was young, I didn't realize that you could call it voice acting. I didn't know that I could actually become a job. And now here I am today wanting to become a voice actress. And it's because of this game. And my sister would always do Sparks' voice. I would look at my boy, look at how cute you are. Hi! But, uh, <laughs> um, but the thing is, like, we would make up little stories, and one of them was definitely at Dragon School. And we would just literally just walk around, Spyro would be like, oh, I'm like the school man, like, oh my god. And it, it was so nice because we would play pretend. This is why I love how Spyro's like, it seems to be open world rather than just a platform. Like, you can kind of walk around. It's not fully open world because even uh, Spyro, for some reason, boy can't swim, boy will drown. But right, let, me, let me heal Sparks while I'm at it. Um, so the thing is, is, it was nice to be able to experience this with my whole family and play this, like, all the time. But it was also good because I could play it at my own, like, however I wanted to. Like, with Crash Bandicoot and everything, I never got into Crash, by the way. So I played a few, I, I played a bit of Crash on the channel, which I really want to go back into Crash. I want to play more platformer games on the channel, and definitely one of them is going to be Crash. But with Crash, it's not semi-open world, so you really can't, like, run around like how Spyro is. So, 
why I love Spyro so much and why it was like the game for me was because I can make my own stories within it and I remember a lot of stories and one of them was Dragon School and how Spyro was either playing hooky from school trying to find the other dragons and it was really funny because there was no other dragons his age around at the time and it was just like, yo, man, like, where, where are my friends? Where are my friends at? Where are they going? So it was good. It was like one of those fond memories that I have. And the daddy dragons, gotta always love them. They were like the professors in my sense because they always teach Spyro something. Do you realize that? They always teach our boys something. But anyway, that was my story for the day. I want to know your guys' Spyro stories. Do you have wow. any? Wow. I see you've been busy rescuing dragons, Yeah. Spyro. Yes, I have been. You may travel to the Peacekeeper's world yes, if you go. like. Yes, go. Um, maybe? I mean, I want to come back, but you better not be like, yo, man, like, you got, you got to pay your way. Like, psh. Like, psh. Are you ready to go? I'm ready to go! Here we go, my boy. He's just, like, just imagine jumping up somebody's head. Yes, boy. Yes. Entering Peacekeeper's world. Look at that. Gorgeous. That's right, Spyro. Traveling. I gotta get a balloon thing and just make, put him in here, like. There he is, just, just traveling. Love you, boy! I like this, the details, even in the basket. Oh, it's, it's dark. Can't wait to see this. It falls in the water. <laughs> Here we go! Oh, snap! Da, 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 da. Oh my god, here we go. Here we go! I can't. This music, okay, the music has always been, I've been always fond of the music on Spyro, but this song, always in my head. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. Spyro, you are boot camp, boy! This daddy dragon. Yo! Here we go. We score. Welcome to Peacekeepers. Hi. Look how our treasure has been stolen and turned against us. Indeed. Please. Recover our treasures. I like your voice. Oh. Collect treasure. Got it. Yeah. We got this. We got it, boy. We're gonna be fine. Yes, Daddy Dragon number sixteen. He got sixteen daddies. All right, let's see here. Ba, 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 ba. Oh god. Ah! Yes. New world, more gems to get. Oh my god! Yes, the cannons. Boy. Good boy. Boy no. Boy no. Wait, no. Wait, can I? I can. I can still, yes! Sparrow, don't go to war, Sparrow. It's not good for you. Do, 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 do. This looks exactly the same! Oh my, see, this is why I'm so glad I'm going into this blind, because, like, I didn't really... Oh, God. Bunnies, bun buns. Bun bun. Hey, bun bun. Because I saw, like, samples of it online, but I never... Boy, boy, he can't get me. Haha, <laughs> in your face. Do you can't get me? You're not smart. Do 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 do. Ba -da -ba -ba. Cacti. Yes. Burn and roast them. Give me. I want some cactus fruit. Oh, they shake it off. Let's see. I know there's a thing I have to explode. Correct me if I'm wrong. The oh, bunny noises. The oh, bunnies are just jumping around and having fun. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, I don't want to kill you. Again, my rule is don't don't attack them unless Sparks really needs them. I should have forgotten just that one gem. Uh, moving on. Hey, get me. That's your boy. You think? Oh my God! Boys, boys, you are. Are you? Wait, are they mooning me? Yes. You see that boom! You see that boom! They kept that in! Here, do it again! See, they, they moon you. you. You think that's funny? Nice bum! Zuck. There's nobody in that one. As far as I just, you don't match. You, you don't match for me, okay? Hey, dude. No match for me at all. Boo, boo, boo. Alright, let's see. There's more jumps. Duh, duh, duh. Oh, I'm not going in there! Boys, boys. You got your butt! Here we go. Your butt's gonna go on fire. Yeah, yeah. You know what? That was her! Again, Spyro, what is with you when making people's butts go on fire? Boo, boo. Get it, Spyro. Spyro, don't fall. Shaboopy. 
Get it! Let's see. Daddy Dragon. Who be you? Who be it? Magnus! Heck yeah! Hey, Spyro! Yeah. Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job. He has been. You. He's so cool. Make sure to keep him strong. I by will. Feeding him lots of butterflies. <laughs> oh my god! Like, stop it! Your guys are so cool. <laughs> Give me the butterflies. Sparks is a good boy. He's 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 a good friend. This is funny how it's like if you saw a dragonfly just randomly following you, it's just like one of those people that are just like, hey, 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 Spyro, hey, hey, Spyro, how'd you do it? Hey, and just like you don't even know who the person is. It's like when he was introduced to him, it's like, now they're best friends. I don't want a dragonfly as best friend. That'd be fun. Magnus was cool. You, you fat boy. <laughs> oh. You guys can't hide from me! Give me your butt. <laughs> boop, boop. Oh, I didn't finish over. Oh, no, no, no. Boy, you missed completely. Do you realize that? The Spyro, just uh, the your newcomers of Spyro. It does get challenging after a while for certain levels. Just to warn you. Do, 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 do. Not yet. Do, 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 do. Dry Canyon. Sparrow's at the Dragon Boot Camp. Do 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 do. No, I went this way already. Oh my nose. Do 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 do. Always in my head. Like even now, this is the the song that I always go back to on Sparrow. I don't know why. I don't have to do that yet. Oh yes, I do. Explode you. Yes. Do. Spire all the way. Maybe? I'm gonna say. Yep. Yes! I love how true they stay to it though, like the original. Oh, here we go. Whoa. Thank God gems don't get like glitched out and then like fall in somewhere. That'd be horrendous. Do, 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 do. Ah, gotta explode you. Use him, yeah. Sparrow, don't. Oh, no! Sorry, Sparks. So so sorry. It's like Sparks is like, I'll take the, I'll take the pain for you, bro. I'll take you. You're my bro, man. You're my bro. I'll take the pain. Oh, gotta line that up. There we go. Explode him. Yes. Right on cue. What's your favorite color of Sparks, by the way? Always like the original yellow. Oh, we got. Dr. Shemp. I'm not going anywhere yet. I'm not finished with this one. How much more do I need? Let's see. We got, wow, we need a lot more gems. One more daddy dragon and one egg. Egg stealers! Egg stealers be coming out. We ain't be happy for that. That's it. We don't, we don't appreciate you egg stealers. I mean, maybe we, they just want to be loved, okay? If you love the egg stealers, let me know what you love about them. I like them, like, I, I do, like, I have to admit, I do like them, but they, they, they remind me of, like, little kids, they're like, nah, 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 I'm gonna tattletale on you. Just go away, you stupid younger sibling. Go. Eh, eh. Yes. Sparrow just breaks. Do, 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 do. Love this music. I have to go down there still. Fudge nuggets. Let's see. Thank you. Yes, save me, please. Oh, oh, oh my. There we go. Ice cavern. I'm not ready. I'm not. There's so many places in this world. I just realized that. Save me. Thank you. So that's just the lead there. Where's the next daddy dragon? There's one. What's that laugh? Sort of laugh. What the heck? Oh, it's the balloon dude. Come on, dude. You get, he's gonna be like, you need to get like 20 daddy dragons, and I'm gonna be like, you know what? Screw you. <laughs> Punch yourself in the face. Imagine if like you can make your own dragons. Oh, like, oh, how awesome would that be? 
That'd be so cool. I would love that. Like, like have a have you make your own OCs, your dragon sonas and everything. Oh god. Oh god, I'm gonna have to jump over here and I. There's that. All right, so I gotta get. Sorry, I'm sorry, Mr. Buns. Why is it always they're always gonna be cute little creatures? Spyro, why? Why? That's 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 no man. You don't do that. That's hurting little poor little creatures. You don't do that, man. You don't do that. Rest in peace, Bun Bun. Rest in peace. <laughs> If you guys would like me to live stream the originals on um, on this guy's squad, I'd love to do that as live stream. Here we go. All right. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Leap of faith. Oh god. I'm like, oh, he, he cannot make that. He cannot. There is no way he is going to make that. Wow. I believe in my bro so much, right? <sighs> I got this! I got to do it! Ah! No, I can't. I can't. He's not gonna make that. There's gotta be another way. Right? I feel like you be, you be, uh, you be not telling the truth here. It's too high. There's gonna be another ledge. Whoa, spiral. Did you see that face? It's like, grr! Do, 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 do. Let's see what balloon dude wants. What do you want? I guess you kill me. The magic crafters world is far away and very dangerous. Okay. Maybe if you find 1200 stolen treasure, I'll show it to you. Fine. Jerk. Okay, he doesn't want he doesn't want daddy. The other guy wanted daddy dragons. This guy wants money. Okay, that's reasonable. Aha, wait. I can probably knock something down. Let's see. Boop, 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 boop. No. Aha! Aha! Right there. Boop, 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 boop. Love you. Shablammy. That's right, Spyro. That's right, my bro. We got this. Also, who's your favorite other Spyro character? Actually, I shouldn't even been asking that yet because that's not until later on in the other games when we get more characters. Spyro, he looks so angry. He's all like, yo, no, now he doesn't. When you like leave him alone, he looks angry sometimes. Okay, be the faith boy. Spyro! You just witnessed a very strange, sad death of my boy Spyro. <gasps> you chuax. You make me start over. You make me start over. <laughs> Got no more gems. I like how they turn into other things. Oh wait. I'm gonna find my way back over there. You make it so difficult for me. I just, I just, I didn't do that. It's my fault. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna stop here. All right, my thoughts on this level. It brought me back. It literally, okay, well, I just looked. I, I don't know why I just did that. It brought me back to my childhood. It really is, the nostalgia is there. Toys for Bob, you did an amazing job on this, but it, the nostalgia is there, especially with the music, too. I mean, even with my sister, she was saying, I hope that the music is, like, 100%, because that's what made the Spyro games for her. And with me, I, for one, just love how the levels are pretty much exactly the same. But I'm so happy that I'm playing this with you guys, because this is obviously my childhood. I, it's, like, just, just happiness and positivity all around. This is my boy. This is my hero. Hero. And this level, it was challenging. It gets challenging, just so you guys know, I'm warning you. You may think, yeah, yeah, this is like a game for kids, but it's not just a game for kids. It's a game for all ages, which basically means that it's going to be challenging for everybody. And especially if you're not good at, like, figuring out the physics of things, such as myself, because I'm no scientist. When you're trying to jump on certain platforms, it gets very, very challenging. And me and my boy Sparrow here, we, uh, we get extremely challenged when it comes to those platformers. But remember what I said about the goo. I will bring up the goo, and it might not be that color purple goo, in like other levels of Spyro when we go through our Let's Play series of Spyro the Dragon and also Spyro Reignited Trilogy, there is one level that will always be considered my nightmare level and you guys will know why later on. But I'm so, again, I'm so glad this is back. I'm like getting, 
the chills are here because I feel like I'm actually sitting down in my basement right now playing Spyro again as a kid. So I'm I'm a kid again. This is Kid Cat. Nice Kid Cat. Get it like Kid Cat. Hey. But no, it's funny because um oh look at him. Ah! <laughs> I wanted to just do like a reenactment of like the Spyro movements, but that's my question. Okay, guys. What age do like dragons become daddy dragons? Like when is he gonna end up standing on two feet? That's my question because dang. There's dragons in this world so far? Awesome. On par awesome. Their designs are amazing. Again, if you guys want to guess who my favorite daddy dragon is of all time, feel free to leave your guesses down below. And also, I want to know, what did you love about this episode? And what did you love about this, you know, this journey so far in general? I mean, if you're new to Spyro, I basically welcome you and you're going to love it. You're absolutely going to love it. The positivity, the energetic... Like, the, the energy is real, you know, it's alive. The high energy is here, and this game is perfect not only just for people who do casual, like, streams, it's perfect for anybody who just wants to, you know, especially if you're loud and crazy like me, this game is perfect for you. Perfect. It's perfect for the brand of Miss Cat's going. <laughs> if you guys want more Spyro, be sure to get this up to 500 likes because we will continue the journey. And also be sure to share if you guys are loving Spyro so far. We would appreciate it if you share these episodes, if you love them with your friends, your family, your coworkers, whoever you want to, even online. We have a Twitter account that you could tag us in. And also be sure to subscribe if you want more Spyro content because there's going to be a ton that I'm planning. We're also planning fun things on our Twitter account, so be sure to give us a follow there. Be sure to give this a big thumbs up. And also don't forget to hit the bell notification because if you don't, then you're going to miss out on Spyro episodes. And if you're true fan i'm sure you don't want to do that but anyway guys i hope you have an amazing day you stay safe out there and as always miss cats until the next video embrace your inner fangirl and you're in a fanboy i'm doing this weird every single day come on sparrow let's go we're both gonna fly out together ready try to make make sure that we get to the platform ready here we go see you guys Woo!